Does anyone remember a time before turrets? A golden age before minions mindlessly pushed against each other. Where you never had to purchase items to upgrade your base stats and competitive PvP actually meant player versus player instead of player versus patience. I remember that time too. A glorious time, filled with MMOs as far as the eye could see. Uh, on second thought, that trend blew dick too. Currently, the industry is obsessed with crafting, open world, and MOBAs. Which brings us to an unusual competitive shooter. No turrets, no nexus, no bases, and no earning EXP for your champions. This western themed shooter is solely based on skill shots and quick reactions. With a manual reload and lightning fast rounds, you'll constantly find yourself wanting more. And that's not to say Secret Ponchos clearly wasn't inspired by MOBAs. Each character is unique with an interesting backstory with their own special moves and styles. It honestly reminds me of the Gorillas meets the Wild West. Something the Gorillas might have done if they didn't start sucking dick instead. Oh what, too, too soon? Is it too soon to say the gorillas suck? Cause they fucking suck. Sometimes you'll be fighting 1v1, 3v3, or a domination type game where the more you kill, the faster the match ends. After each round, I was dying for more. Speaking of dying, you'll do that a lot. The game isn't without its flaw, it's not noob friendly, and the netcode could use some work, but since it's a recent release, we can give that one a pass. But fuck noob- Raw oh, horse shit! How many times can I possibly die? With each death though, you'll get a little bit better. A little bit more quick on the draw. I am Sulphur. I am the spinning barrel. Although a weapon is a tool, I am the instrument that pulls the- NO! NO THAT'S BULLSHIT! Nah, fuck it, let's just show a montage.
Secret Poncho's fucking rules. You're doing yourself a disservice to you, your family, and the developers if you don't buy it. 